twin flame. It's a curious fact that many people at some time in their life meet someone with whom they feel a very special bond and relationship. Some feel there is almost a psychic or telepathic link. This might, might be a family member, someone they know romantically, or even someone they just know socially, or someone they just know from social media, like Facebook. One question I often get about such relationships is, are they my twin flame? Twin flames can also be no soulmate, which is possible a more common term. But what is a twin flame? At some time in the past, your spirit and tenty got divided and two people were formed as a result. A bit like the creation of monosotic twins, where one zygotic, zygot splits and form two embryos. But with twin flames, the two entities become one male and one female and can be given form by different mothers at different times in different countries. It is even possible that your twin flame is your mother, father or an other member from your family. When will you meet your twin flame? This is de determined by when you are both re re reincarnated into this life. When the time is right. It may be that you already have met your twin flame at one point in your life, but you didn't know that. Later in your life, you can meet a person again, and then you know that that is your twin flame. Another question they ask me, will we in the future live with each other? That depends on some other factors. You or your twin flame are married, and then is the question, will you or your twin flame stay with the partner. There is also the possibility that you will have a friendship. But what will happen, the bond you have with your twin flame shall stay because it is a very strong bond. If you look at internet, you can find pages where you can read much more about twin flames. I found some quotes from Plato. I found the first one at the website from bellospirit.com and the second one on the website from twinflamekiss.com. I found these two so beautiful that I want to share them with you. According to Greek mytho mythology, humans were originally created with four arms, four legs and a head with two faces. Fearing their power, Zeus split them in two separate beings, condemning them to spend their life in search of the other half. Plato, Plato, the Symposium. And when one of them meets the other half, the actual half of himself, whatever he be a lover of youth or a lover of another sort, the pair are lost in an amazement of love and friendship and intimacy, and one will not be out of the other side, as I may say, even for a moment.
I will thank you for listening.